Oh, now what's happening, everybody? This your boy Dooley Moore. Man, look at that dang on Shelby Ford over there. You hear me? But if y'all want to go ahead on and check out more custom videos of um, custom vehicles, go subscribe to my Big Dooley Custom and Review channel here on my YouTube. If you want to check out my music, go to my Big Dooley channel. Well, sorry about that. But as y'all know in my previous video here at McReed Ford, I already said I was gonna go inquire about a vehicle I was looking at for the Sport. And I wanna get into something different. Everything looking good. They're willing to do a trade-off of the vehicle I'm getting in right now, which is excellent in my book. And I don't know some cash with it, you know. I gotta get something bigger for me and myself. So whenever I get myself situated and ready, all that I gotta do is come up here, come back, and there it is. Gonna have it. Or if not, they'll find me something more up to date of where they can put it. Yeah. And I would just let they all went into the, you know, me, something better than that one has your soul. I just fucked up with my mind. You know, I just say, you gotta believe in yourself. You gotta go hard. But I gotta keep focused. Got Jesus up on my side. Tell the devil to keep it full. Would you see me? Would you survive? And money's what I'm hoping. I just fucked up with my mind. Got my third eye open. Feel like I'm trapped in time. But I gotta keep focused. Got Jesus up on my side. Tell the devil to keep it full. Would you see me? Would you survive? Everyone is what I'm hoping. Vlog video. You gotta believe in yourself and you gotta go hard at all times in order to achieve what you're trying to achieve. And if y'all know me, I work hard all the time. I try staying prayed up. You know, always talking to God Himself. And I stay humble and I be persevering and you know, and I just try to give it all I got because I want better in life. I'm tired of being at the bottom. I've been at the bottom too long. Growing up in New Orleans, 20 plus years, you feel me? And now I'm in Texas and I'm trying to elevate myself, man. I'm tired of being at the bottom. I gotta start working my way up. One thing I do have to work on, also before I can even become a business owner or anything, I have to focus on my credit. I got a lot of bad shit on my credit I need to get off. So I need to go ahead and start getting with somebody who can work on my credit. If I got to pay them every month, whatever, so they can start removing shit from my credit because I need that done. I'm tired of having derogatory marks and hard inquiries, soft inquiries, and all kinds of other stuff that's really just be hurting my credit for no reason, you heard me? And I mean, I got to get myself together. I got to be clean. I got a clean background, so I got to have a good, clean credit history. So that way, when I'm ready to start my business, I'll be able to get anything that I want out here. Even without a down payment, I don't have that A1 credit because in this world, they don't tell you nothing. But what I'm teaching my son, when he start understanding and getting to everything, keep good credit. Get credit, couple credit cards, get 30%, use only 30% of your limit, pay it back on time or before time so you can keep them payments on time so your credit score can keep rising. And you hold them for quite a bit of time so that way you can... They can trust you because they're gonna be like, well, you've been established credit and you've been holding it for a period of time, you know, quite a few years. So you're trustworthy, you know, because they see that you can get something and hold something. Get like little furniture for your place or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And pay that shit off. As long as people can see that you pay it off and pay it off on time, your credit score goes up. And, you know, things like that. Today's video is gonna be pretty short. I'm sorry about that, you know, I'm pretty busy. And I got to go around, you know. I got rounds to make. I got stuff to do. I'm a very busy man, you heard me. But, you know, it never hurts to try to check and see. I'm not about to go to no dealership where it's like I did with the charge I had on 24th. I know y'all ain't yeah. seen it. But I will put Snapchat videos of it up on my YouTube channel as well so y'all can see. But I had a 2010 Dodge Charger on 24th. Can you hear me? And... You know, that was in-house. I don't mind doing in-house, but the only thing I hate about in-house because they're going to save you. They're going to save you something that's beyond no. blue book value or NADA value. And then they're going to put their own finances to it. So you may, for a car that's probably like 8000 outright, 
they're gonna charge you about ten thousand for it, and then want to try to charge you about another five or six thousand just for financing. So you really paying almost twenty thousand dollars for ten thousand less than a ten thousand dollar car, and I yeah. hate in house financing. So that route I'm not trying to go. So if I would rather save up the money and get my credit right and go put down on something where I know the interest rate, the APR on the interest rate would be lower, have a lower down payment, cheaper payments, but maybe a longer term. I don't know. But if you put down a nice chunk of change and all that, you have a shorter term with the same amount of payment. So that's the way I'm trying to go in life. I'm tired of hurting. I'm tired of struggling. I'm tired of being at the bottom. I don't want to be blue collar up there, but of course with my music, I want to become famous and rich, but if I'm going to work my ass off, I want to be comfortable in life and I want to be able to do what I want when I want and how I want it. And I don't want to have to answer to nobody or anything like that. And the song that's playing will also be on my other YouTube channel, which all the links will be in the description below. My Facebook page, my artist page, my YouTube, my Instagram, my Snapchat, my Twitter. Follow me on all social media, and I'll be sure to follow you back. You subscribe to my channel, I will subscribe to your channel, even if you don't post no content. I will just subscribe back because that's to show you my dedication of being who I am. And I go by Big Duel if you don't know, but also for my vlogging channel, it's Dooley More. And for my review channel, it's called Dooley's Custom Reviews. So once I start my car lot, Y'all gonna be seeing everything I get, everything I do, even from going to auctions, buying cars, all that's gonna be on the customs and reviews channel. So, but everything starts with Dooley, and Dooley is spelled D U L E Y, like Dooley, you feel me? But it's Dooley, you know me. I'm gonna say it the way I wanna say it, everybody else say it. But, you know, I just want to give y'all this here, you heard me? Another vlog for the day. Y'all be easy, stay light, stay fresh. Stay prayed up, handle your business. Take the good with the bad, the bitter with the sweet, the ups, the downhaul, ass on all feet, and mash on concrete. You feel me? Stay humble. Go for your dreams. Go for your goals. Don't let no one else knock you or tell you anything other. Live your life and do you, you hear me? And I just want to tell y'all, y'all all have a blessed day and I'm out of You hear me? Huh? Totally.